Welcome to Daily Scripture Reading. I do not own the rights to this music. First Chronicles chapter 2, this is the Amplified Version. Genealogy, 12 sons of Jacob, Israel. These are the sons of Israel, Reuben, Simeon, Levi, Judah, Issachar, Zebulun, Dan, Joseph, Benjamin, Naphtali, Gad, and Asher. The sons of Judah, Ur, Onan, and Shelah. The three were born to him by Shua's daughter, the Canaanitess. Ur, Judah's eldest, was evil in the Lord's sight, and he put him to death. Tamar, Judah's daughter-in-law, bore him Perez and Zerah. Judah's sons were five in all. The sons of Perez, Hezron, and Hamul. The sons of Zerah, Zimri, Ethan, Heman, Calcol, and Dara, five in all. The son of Carmi, Achar, the troubler of Israel, who violated the ban by taking things from Jericho that had been banned. The son of Ethan, Azariah. Genealogy of David, the sons of Hezron, who were born to him, Jeremiel, Ram, and Chilobai, that is, Caleb. Ram became the father of Amenadab, and Amenadab became the father of Nashon, leader of the sons of Judah. Nashon became the father of Salma. Salma became the father of Boaz. Boaz became the father of Obed, and Obed became the father of Jesse. Jesse became the father of Eliab, his firstborn, Abinadab the second, Shimea the third, Nathaniel the fourth, Radai the fifth, Ozam the sixth, David the seventh. Their sisters were Zariah and Abigail, the sons of Zariah, Abishai, Joab, and Asahel, three. Abigail gave birth to Amasa, and the father of Amasa was Jether, the Ishmaelite. And Caleb, the son of Hezron, had sons by his wife Azubah and by Jerioth. Azubah's sons were Jeshur, Shobab, and Ardon. Azubah died, and Caleb married Ephrath, who bore him Hur. Hur became the father of Uri, and Uri became the father of Bezalel, the skillful craftsman who made the furnishings of the tabernacle. Later, when Hezron was 60 years old, he married the daughter of Makur, the father of Gilead, and she bore him Segub. Segub became the father of Jair, who later had 23 cities in the land of Gilead. But Geshur and Aram took from them Havath Jair, with Kenath and its villages, 60 towns in all. All these were the sons, descendants of Makir, the father of Gilead. After Hezron died in Caleb, Ephrathah, Abijah, Hezron's wife, bore him Asher, the father of Tekoa, the sons of Jeremiel, the firstborn of Hezron, Ram, the firstborn, Buna, Oren, Ozim, and Ahijah. Jeremiel had another wife named Adara. She was the mother of Onam. The sons of Ram, the firstborn of Jeremiel, were Maz, Jamin, and Eker. The sons of Onam, Shammai, and Jada. The sons of Shammai, Nadab, and Abishur. The name of Abishur's wife was Abihel. She bore him Aban and Molid. The sons of Nadab, Selet, and Apam. Selet died childless. The son of Apam, Ishai. The son of Ishai, Shishan. The son of Shishan, Ali. The sons of Jada, the brother of Shammai, Jether and Jonathan. Jether died childless. The sons of Jonathan, Peleth and Zaza. These were the sons, descendants of Jeremiel. Shishan had no sons, only daughters, but Shishan had a servant, uh, an Egyptian whose name was Jarha. So Shishan gave his daughter to Jarha, his servant as a wife. She bore him Atai. Atai became the father of Nathan, and Nathan became the father of Zabad. Zabad became the father of Ephlau, and Ephlau became the father of Obed. Obed became the father of Jehu, and Jehu became the father of Azariah. Azariah became the father of Helez, and Helez became the father of Elisa. Elisa became the father of Sismai. 
and Sismai became the father of Shalem. Shalem became the father of Jechamiah, and Jechamiah became the father of Elishama, the sons of Caleb, the brother of Jeremiel. Misha, his firstborn, was the father of Ziph, and his sons, Merisha, was the father of Hebron. The sons of Hebron, Korah, Tapua, Rekim, and Shema. Shema became the father of Raham, the father of Jorakim, and Rekim became the father of Shammai. The son of Shammai was Maon. Maon became the father of Bethzur. Ephah, Caleb's concubine, gave birth to Haran, Moza, and Gazez. Haran became the father of Gazez. The sons of Jadai, Regim, Jotham, Jishan, Pelet, Ephah, and Shaph. Maka, Caleb's concubine, gave birth to Sheber and Terhana. She also bore Shaph, the father of Madmana, and Sheba, the father of Macbena and of Gibeah. And the daughter of Caleb was Aksa. These were the sons, descendants of Caleb, the sons of Hur, the firstborn of Ephrathah, Shobal, the father of kiriath Jerem, Salma, the father of Bethlehem, and Heroth, the father of beth -Gader. Shobal, the father of kiriath Jerem, had other sons, descendants, Haroe, half of the Manah, Manah, Hathites in Judah, and the families of kiriath Jerem, the Ephrites, Puthites, Shumathites, and Mishrites. From these came the Zorathites and the Eshtalites, the sons, descendants of Salma, Bethlehem, the Netophilites, Atroth, Beth Joab, and half of the Man Manahathites, the Zorites, the families of scribes who lived at Jabez, the Tirathites, Shemiathites, and Sukathites. These are the Canaanites who came from Hamath, the father of the house of Rechab. The end. God bless you and thank you for joining me today.